Emily Dickinson's poem, There Is No Frigate Like a Book, written in Dickinson's usual ballad meter, uses metaphors of travel and transportation to extol the power of literature to take readers on grand mental journeys. Indeed, no ship can reveal the wonders of the world like a book that takes us to distant lands. Nor are there any horses that can match a page of prancing poetry. Even the poorest people may be thus transported without having to pay any toll. Literature is an affordable means of travel. This is the entire poem. There is no frigate like a book to take us lands away, nor any coursers like a page of prancing poetry. This traverse may the poorest take without a press of toll. How frugal is the chariot that bears the human soul. This poem is another example of what might be classified as a definition poem. In this case, the speaker defines the power and potential of literature. The central conceit of travel is supported by various images involving transportation on one hand, frigate, coursers, traverse, toll, and chariot, and diction and metonymy of literature on the other hand, that is, book, page, and poetry. Playful alliteration celebrates the power of literature and the imagination. 